Welcome one and all to another venture of Fat Man Goes Wild. So in the last video, you saw me put this blade together. I have since sharpened it. It does trim hair. But there's one more thing that I really need before this battery dies. And that is the start of a sheath which I do have a piece of wood here that I will be cleaning off. And like every other part, I'll be going through the steps on making it. See if you can even see that. And you can't. So I will actually be going through the part of making this, sanding it all down, cutting it to shape, getting it ready so that it actually is a fully flush knife and then something I might do off camera or on camera I don't know yet is etching this so that it is more personalized so all that being said let me get my sharpie put a new battery in and we will actually design Put that right there where I want the dill to go. Take a rough shape. So now that we got a rough shape, I'm gonna cut this out twice so that I can start dremeling, getting all this up to how I want it. So now that I have two shapes that are roughly the same size, obviously some cleanup will be happening in after I get all this. Now all I gotta do is grind out both sides. And then glue them together, sand them down to a better area as I am being eaten by mosquitoes. So
So I did skip a step. Um, I was having a little difficulty cutting out this. So I did use my angle grinder to kind of just grind a quick thing out. It fits. It is a little loose. Hopefully when I join or glue that on there, it will be a little better. So all I gotta do is glue this and then sand it, shape it, maybe decorate it. <coughs> Gazuntite. So it'll be good. So when I get that all glued, I will show you guys. Welcome to the part or finished part of this where I've got the sheath. I need to thin it down still a little bit more, but I did just rough out the edges. Now, I was sweating bullets and it's raining, so I didn't really film it. But, obviously, it's not going to stay in there because it's just kind of a friction hold. Obviously, that's not going to, if I barely grab onto that and I try to let go of this. Yeah. But I like having the sheath for it. I may go in to engrave. Actually, I will right now. So I am going to finish this up by engraving my logo. So. And there we go. One completed knife with sheep. Still kind of warm. Go figure, clove fire. Got little E-L in it. So, stay tuned for the next, uh, stay tuned for the next venture where it's gonna be put to use. And come on, we all know that's your favorite part of the video.